Okay, for today's CF680C2 maintenance minute, we're gonna be inspecting the VSV actuator. Specifically, what we're gonna be looking for is to ensure that the lock nut and lock key are seated correctly and lock wired correctly. As you can see right now, that the lock nut is not seated. It is actually backed off the piston body a little bit and there is an absence of lock wire. So what we need to do when we see this condition is go ahead and tighten and seat the lock nut Make sure the key is positioned correctly, and then we're gonna go ahead and lock wire it. Please refer to the AMM for specific torques on the lock nut when you're doing this procedure. Okay, I've gone ahead and tightened and torqued the lock nut. The key is in the correct position. So what I'm gonna do now is go ahead and lock wire the lock nut to the lock key. Okay, now you can see that the lock wire has been installed on the lock nut and lock key. That's just going to provide an anti-rotation feature to make sure that the lock nut does not make its way up towards the rod end of the piston. Uh, very important that when you're inspecting the VSV actuators that you're checking for this condition because it can definitely affect performance on the engine.